This barber is behind the haircuts of some of the world's most famous soccer players. Ahmed Al Sanawi has styled everyone from Paul Pogba to Eden Hazard. We went to his shop near London to get a fresh new cut and find out more about him and his rise in the barber game. So, how exactly do you become a barber to all these stars? Uh, it started when I was um, a young kid uh, going to the barber shop and just had enough of people messing my hair. So I took Matt into my own hands, literally, and um, started cutting my own hair. Then it started becoming my brother, my dad, um, my neighbours, and then eventually worked in the shop, built a, a clientele, and then opened up the uh, opened up A-Star Barbers in 2013. Right, um, Huey, can you mix the bleach for me, please, mate? How are you feeling about this now? Oh, <laughs> regret. Immediate regret. <laughs> it's probably about a year and a half ago. People started bleaching their hair. I think Messi done it, then Ramsey done it. Obviously, Pogba always bleaching his hair. Aguero as well. Um, yeah, so he went for the silver one, didn't Silver, he? look, yeah, silver fox. <laughs> <laughs> Before opening his new barbershop, Ahmed was cutting hair at the Chelsea training ground every week, but his journey wasn't always an easy one. I was born in Baghdad, uh, come here when I was nine years old. So yeah, um, certain people say I've come far, you know, where I've come from and opened up a lot of opportunities and you've got to grab them. I cut Pogba's hair, I think it was two years ago. Um, uh, I, I was cutting uh, Zuma at the time, and um, he seen my Instagram and sort of gave me a shout saying, listen, I need you in Manchester. And then I went there, and um, that's when we done the ha a hashtag equal in his hair, because he was doing a campaign for that. And then, yeah, ever since I've been cutting his hair. We've done the, the red and the blonde for Pogba around the side, and it started trending, everyone's starting to do it. And then we, I think we've done like a flame on the side, so it looks like his hair was on fire. So that's one of my favourite haircuts. Um, it's, it's on FIFA now as well. I do quite a bit of travelling, so probably I travel maybe once a week. I was at the World Cup, um, it was, uh, had the pleasure to look after the French national team. Then winning the World Cup was like uh, icing on the cake. And then obviously on Instagram there, saying like, dedicate this to A-Star, you, you won the cup too. That was like, wow, amazing. Wow. Yo, one day you guys want my brother, A-Star, bro. Yeah. Hey. Hey. I need to hey. see hey. you, bro. Hey. A-Star, you keep. Bro, you, hey. you got every player on the team, bro. You win the cup. Hey, so. hey, hey, A-Star. For the young barbers out there, um, and I get this quite a lot, you just gotta love what you do, you gotta love it. And when you love it, that's when you try and aim to be the best that you can be. Um, you can't be half-hearted at it. 